Good morning. This is Idella Ann back with you on this beautiful Saturday morning. It's raining outside. The floodgates just opened up. And so if you hear any noise in the background, it's either the television playing in the den or the sound of the rain falling. And I love that sound. It's so cool, soothing and and calming and um, it makes me want to stay home and play with my pens and my inks and my notebooks. But before we get started, I'm going to um, open up this um, Clarity Premium Pen Handwriting Nib that I purchased from Hobby Lobby yesterday. It comes with the um, pen and some inks and it cost me $16.99. And so I'm very curious to see how this is going to write. But before I do that, I want to show you a traveler's notebook that I made. I bought this leather from Hobby Lobby. Um, I'm not trying to plug Hobby Lobby. It's just that that's where I get my stuff. Anyway, I made this traveler's notebook out of leather from Hobby Lobby. And on the inside, oops, I have it upside down. On the inside is a pocket. It uh, doesn't hold much, but it's a pocket nonetheless. And then I put in three moleskins. Um, this is a, the, a thicker of the thicker of the three. And here's another one. So this is lined. This one is lined. They're all lined. And then this is the back cover. And this is one of those pens that has the, um, I'll have to show you, that has the light and the laser. You can see that there. And what I do is, well, I can't, I'm recording on my phone, but I use this part of the pen to um, tap down when I'm texting on my phone. And so, <clears throat> this is what I made. I made it, and I love it. And I think it's adorbs. And um, so this is the roll of leather that I cut this from, okay, from Hobby Lobby. And I also have the black leather, okay, that I'm going to make another one from. And this is very, very flimsy, but I'm going to um, make another one. But I have to buy another piece. I hope I can find a matching piece. If not, I will use a different color leather. But anyway, I'm into making these um, notebooks. And... They're just so much fun. So anyway, um, let's go ahead and open up the pen. And let's see what we've got here. I don't know why I'm so excited about this pen. But I just am. I guess because simplicity seems to be the thing that makes me happy. I've got so much to show you. I have so many videos to make because I have so much stuff that I want to share with you guys. All right, so here's the pen. It's very, very lightweight, which is, I didn't think it was going to be anything substantial. Um, and here is the cap and some ink. And the other ink. I have no idea what colors they are, but we're about to find out, aren't we? So let's throw out the trash. I like to keep these and put them inside my um, my journal so that I can refer to them at a later date. So like here in my whole Benici, I have... Um, like some of my Goulet pen orders, 
I just put the packaging slip inside um, so that I'll have it as a reference. Um, this comes with my came with my Twisby pen. It just talks about the pen, so I glue that in. And um, this one talks about my sailor pen. So I just glue these things in and I keep them because if I really like something, I want to go ahead and maybe buy another. So I'll just stick that in there. Here's a little sailor bookmark when I ordered my sailor pen. And so I just use it as a bookmark because these things here, they get on my nerves. But anyway. Um, and I'll glue that down and I'll have it for future reference. So anyway, here we go. Do I need light? Uh, well, maybe. Yeah, I think that's a little bit better. Whoops. Okay. So here's the nib. I don't know if it's aluminum, stainless steel. I'm really not sure. But it looks like it has a little gold um, tint to it. Let's see. Can I make this bigger? Okay, so that's the nib. It's plastic. And it says manuscript. Okay. And there's, oh, okay. Let's see. Oh, I do. Oh, this. Oh, nice. Am I? Okay. Uh, come on out. So I have to get uh, an injector in order to put an ink of my choice in there so okay I like that um, so let's go ahead and put this ink in and let's see I don't know how to, okay and then put this part back on I don't know how this is going to work because I was not able to apply any pressure. Does this come off? Let's see what happens here. Did I just break it? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Lisa, Lisa, Lisa. I'll push this back in here because that just came out. Okay, Lisa Caldwell. Alright, so I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to prevent this from sliding in and out. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, okay. All right. Just have to play with it a little bit. And let's put this back on. Oh, brother. Okay. All right. And now... Do I want to cap it? Yep. Okay. All right. So there we go. We got the ink inside. And, uh... Let's see what we've got. All right, so let's open up uh, to a clean page. A book. Oh, I realize I did so much work. Right. So. Let's see what happens. Let's see what we've got here. So today is, oh, it's juicy. 421, 23. I didn't have any struggle. I didn't have to shake. I didn't have to do anything. 
So that's good. The ink came out right away. All right, and so let's write something. So what color is that? Like black, gray, black. All right, so today I am using my clarity pen from I'm gonna have to skip lines I'll be lobbying and skipping lines because I'm not used to such a thick lib and nib and um I'm used to writing with a fine <clears throat> a fine uh, nib but this will be good for like bright uh bright colors like pinks or neon colors that don't show up as well as dark colors. Okay. Um, pen writes very smoothly. I don't know what color ink this is. Um, But I will look it up. But this is nice. I like it. I like this pen. Let's see. I can draw a nice heart. Dun 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 dun. Bump bump bump. Bink bink bink. Draw my little tree with my star on the top. Okay. Nice. I don't feel that I can use this pen um, for my best handwriting. But for $16.99, it goes in with all my other pens because it's nice. I like it. I like it. Try it. You'll like it. Okay. I have to hold my pen a different way. I never held a pen with this grip. That always hurts right up in here. Since a little girl, everybody used to try to get me to hold my pen the right way. What they perceived as the right way. But for me, this is the right way. So, um, let's see. Um, um, I don't know. Uh, I'm struggling. To think of something to write. Now it appears that the ink dries fast, so let's see. Yeah. Nice. Very nice. This is not disappointing at all. I just wish that the nib was a little finer. But it is what it is. For $16.99. And I'm going to add it to my pen collection because I think it's cute. I would recommend this to somebody who is just starting out. And using um, nib fountain pens or calligraphy pens. Um, because you're not spending a lot of money. On pens with gold nibs and you get to uh, feel the difference between using a ballpoint pen and a nib pen fountain pen and um, yeah nice very nice well anyway that concludes this video I'm getting ready to make another one I just have to clear my desk and set up everything and I'll see you in a little bit thank you for watching Idella Ann